Kat with Meet Feel Living, and today has been a really busy day. Um, I actually uh, received a couple packages in the mail, though, and I thought, I opened them all, and then I thought, you know what, it might actually be interesting for some people to see the type of stuff that I purchase regularly um, on my carnivore journey. None of these things are sponsored, although I do have some affiliate links for a couple of them, um, and I'll go ahead and tell you that as I unpackage them. But these are things that I use on a regular basis, and so I don't know if unboxings aren't interesting or anybody's cup of tea, let me know in the comments down below because I don't want to keep doing something if somebody's not interested in it. I also started doing some reviews of some products that you can look for here in the near future. I have a couple actually that I need to put out of things that I'm trying in my carnivore kitchen and um, that you know I just thought I would try it before I recommend it because that's kind of my whole thing is I'm not going to recommend it to anybody or post any affiliate links for anybody if it's not something that I use and legitimately love. So the first foremost thing, coffee, right? Hmm. You know that I am addicted to coffee. I love coffee. I especially love Nespresso coffee. And that's what this first box is. And it's kind of a big box, so I'll have to kind of set it here and just bring this stuff up. Now I had a, a Nespresso machine at the house in, in Texas. Um, and I did purchase a new one here, which I also need to do a review on, but it is not my favorite, so mm, stay tuned for that. But um, I also have like a Ninja coffee maker that makes like pots of coffee as well as the K-Cups. I try to stay away from K-Cups as much as possible. There's just a lot of controversy about whether or not, you know, what's in them is good, you know, that type of stuff. But they are very convenient, and sometimes the flavors that you can get on the K-Cups, let's just be honest, you just can't find them in, you know, anywhere else. But Nespresso is by far and wide one of my absolute favorite things. Uh, some people might consider it to be a little cost prohibitive, but you can buy the pods at Target and Walmart now. They're not Nespresso brand, they're typically the Starbucks brand or I think it's Pete's at Target. But in any case, this is their new holiday line that came out with just a couple of my all-time favorites. And look, you guys, I actually opened one of them already because that's what's in here. And I can tell you 100% that this one is amazing. It's actually called the Frosted Caramel, 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 Caramel Nut. This is one of their brand new 2023 seasonal flavors. Mmm, <laughs> so good. It's so good. They have a recipe on their website that you could make a caramel nut latte, but of course, I don't do most of those things, but that one, I can 100% tell you, is delicious. Um, oh, and I should read what they say is the... Uh, so it says, says Frosted Caramel Nut, Journey to the Heart of the Holiday Spirit. A caramel and almond flavor embraces our smooth blend of Latin American and African Arabica to bring that festive, festive atmosphere that we've been looking forward to all year long. As the multi, 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 multi cereal note of the coffee becomes one with the warming caramel flavor, an almond vanilla biscuit note emerges, inviting you to take a moment to sit back and enjoy. It says to try it with a dash of cold milk and experience the festive goodness that unfolds in your cup. Love it. I'm even wearing a festive Christmas shirt because the holidays, uh, if you know, you know. Because I was moving, I did not get to decorate for Halloween this year and I am really behind. I haven't put anything up for Christmas yet because I'm still trying to get the house together because Thanksgiving's coming. I have company coming in. Anyways. Fest, I still, whatever, I'm still absolutely just enamored with the holidays. It's my favorite. So also, this one is another, um, this is a, I accidentally pulled this one open. It wasn't sealed well. This one, okay, so they've had vanilla before, but I don't remember if they had this one called Sweet Vanilla. Um, I saw, I, I swear they just had like a regular plain vanilla, but I could be wrong. Um, this one is... You know, as it as it says, there isn't any sugar in any of their coffee, though it says sweet vanilla, but it is not um, like anything sweetened in it. But I, that one, it's it's vanilla, so 
Uh, everybody likes vanilla, it seems. And then this one here is actually an old Stand By Me that I always get. This is not a holiday but one, but it's the rich chocolate. Um, this one is just... It says our velvety smooth blend of Latin American and African Ar Arabica meets chocolate flavor, inviting you to make an occasion of your coffee moment. Like all good dark chocolate, rich and complex, the coffee unfolds layers of flavor. But this has been one of the favorites in my house. This one also, okay, so this is a seasonal, but it is not new. This one comes out every year, peppermint pinwheel. I don't think I need to read the... Um, the description of it, everybody kind of knows peppermint. Peppermint is, you know, peppermint with a little bit of heavy cream. Ah, delicious. Okay, this is another one of their new holiday ones for this year. It's called Festive Black. Oh, I'll see if it's going to focus. It doesn't want to. Festive Black. It says, cozy up with the Festive Black Double Espresso this year. A blend of Arabicas, if I'm saying that wrong, I'm sorry, I don't know, uh, from Honduras, Uganda, and beyond takes you away to an enchanted world of taste that brings you the festive feel. A place where roasted woody aromas with warming sweet spice notes await and a twinkling of the jammy fruit note delights enjoy black or in a reverso i don't know what a reverso is uh where dark chocolate and candy fruit notes are unlocked festive black double espresso invites you to make this your festive escape this season and sorry i wear bifocals and i have a hard time reading so i have to kind of okay <laughs> but this is one of their new ones I had to buy, no, okay, so I don't buy a lot of Nespresso. I usually I'll order a few sleeves and then that lasts me for a while because I also brew pots of coffee. Um, but Nespresso is my most favorite. I had to get a bunch here because I left all my pods back in Texas. I didn't want to take every, I didn't want to take the, take all the pods. This one is roasted hazelnut. Again, not new. It's just one of my favorites. Um, love this one. I love hazelnut. I actually got two of this one. This is that caramel nut. I got two of it because it's a limited edition and they sell out uh, really quick. This one also is a seasonal but not new. It's the gingerbread. It is exactly what it says. It tastes like gingerbread. Love that one as well. Um, yeah, that one's gingerbread. This one also is not new but it is a holiday and it is the pumpkin spice cake. Um, I also really, really love this one because I love pumpkin spice lattes. So this is another one of their new ones. This one's called Seasonal Delight Spice. And this one says, the Seasonal Delight Spice flavor takes you into the sights, sounds, and enchantment of a festive market. Our smooth blend of Latin American and African Arabica gets a delightful spiced and whiny flavor whiny flavor establishing this as the coffee to make magical memories with festive citrus and a mix of spices fills your cup take a break from the everyday this season with this heartwarming flavored coffee add a dash of cold milk and taste the spiced cake notes that emerge i can't wait to try that one and lastly finally golden caramel not new just one of my all-time favorites and you know nespresso always sends you free coffee this one is furtado decaffeinado and then the regular furtado they always send you free samples when you order coffee from them we used to have the original nespresso that took the little tiny pods but it just uh, it, it would it broke on us and then we got another one and that broke on us as well the virtual though I believe it's the virtual is what it's called with the big you know I call them like UFO looking spaceship pods but they that things lasted forever literally forever we just keep it cleaned descaled and never had a single issue out of it the one that I bought here is different than the one that I had back in Texas, and I don't like this one. Um, the coffee's great, and it brews coffee, but I just, I don't like it. It's it's not easy to use, but it's still on Nespresso machine, and I love Nespresso, and so I'm going to make it work. It's just that when the opportunity arises to get the model that I had before, I think that's what I'll probably do. I don't know if that's something that interests you, seeing something like this, and again, um, I can tell you 100% the caramel nut is 
for sure. I might actually put another order in before the holiday season is over because it's so good that I kind of want to have it uh, more often and I'm going to have to hide one of the boxes because when my daughter comes over, she will go through all the coffee. If you think that I'm a coffee drinker, you should see her. She's worse than me. Um, but yeah, so this is, um, this one's already kind of long. So I'm going to end this one and then I have uh, two more that I need to do. I just don't want to make it uh, super super long because it's hard you know people don't always have a lot of time to sit through and watch these kind of things but Nespresso a thousand percent recommend the caramel nut is a win-win uh, let me know again in the comments if this is the kind of stuff that you would be interested in seeing. I'm obviously going to continue all of my regular long-form videos talking about the carnivore diet and vlogging my experiences and that kind of stuff but these are things that I use on a regular basis during my journey so thought maybe it might be interesting uh thank you again for watching if you're a new subscriber here thank you for watching this video i encourage you to sub subscribe like comment share if this is something that interests you and for all of my current subscribers thank you again i absolutely adore you please like comment and share you know i try to answer all of your comments if i can and you know i hope you have a wonderful rest of the night and eat your meat